Secretary Panetta strongly condemns the attacks on U.S. diplomatic facilities in the strongest possible terms. The Secretary extends his deepest sympathies to the families of the victims and to the entire State Department family. The Department has been working closely with the White House and State Department to provide resources to support the security of U.S. personnel and facilities in Libya. I'd like to quickly summarize some of our actions to date. Yesterday, the Secretary authorized the movement of a Marine Corps Fleet Anti-Terrorism Security Team, a fast platoon, into Libya to protect U.S. citizens and secure our embassy in Tripoli. The Department also provided support to evacuate military pers excuse me, American personnel and casualties out of Libya and is supporting the return of the remains of our fallen colleagues to the United States. Over the past 48 hours, the leadership of this Department, including the Secretary and the Chairman, have worked closely with combatant commanders to review our force posture in the region and to ensure that we have the flexibility to respond to requests for assistance or orders as directed by the President of the United States. This Department also continues to work closely with the State Department and our partners throughout the region, including Yemen, Egypt, and Afghanistan, to ensure all missions have any necessary resources from this Department, given the potential for further protests in the coming days.